Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make two super easy and delicious overnight oat recipes. The first one is a bananas faster oatmeal and it's my favorite one. But before we get started, don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoy it, subscribe to my channel, and click the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post new videos. Now the base for both of these oatmeal flavors is basically the same. You're going to need one cup of old-fashioned oats, a quarter cup of brown sugar, a quarter cup of Greek vanilla yogurt, about a half teaspoon of fresh ground cinnamon, and one and one-fourth cups of almond milk. So to get started, I'm going to toast my oats for about five minutes. I'm just going to toast these over medium heat for like three to five minutes just to cook them a little bit because I don't like the thought of eating raw oats. So after these toasted for a bit, I transferred them into a bowl. And to that, I'm going to add the one and one quarter cup of almond milk and the Greek yogurt. Give that a quick mix. Add the brown sugar, cinnamon. Now this is gonna sit in the refrigerator for at least eight hours or better yet, overnight. That's why they're called overnight oats. The longer the oats stay in the fridge, the better. They absorb all that liquid and they turn creamy and delicious. You're gonna have the best texture and flavor. Here I have two bananas that I'm just going to slice into small pieces. Now in a saucepan over medium heat, I'm going to add three tablespoons of butter along with a quarter cup of brown sugar. I'm just going to let that melt real quickly. I'm going to add my bananas. And cook that for like a minute or two and create a really quick and easy banana sauce for topping. Now here is my overnight oats after they've been in the fridge for about eight hours. Here I have my bananas, Foster's bananas. I'm going to add half of this mixture into here. And then save the other half for topping. I'm just gonna fold that in. I'm adding the bananas in here warm because I actually do prefer my overnight oats warm. But if you want them cold, just pop the bananas, Foster in the fridge before combining them in here. Now I'm going to spoon to top these off with a little more of that banana foster topping. Okay, so here's the oatmeal. Look at that. I'm gonna give that a try. Now I'm going to show you guys how to make this blueberry oatmeal that tastes just like a blueberry muffin. Once again, I'm going to toast my oats for about 5 minutes over medium heat. And I'm going to transfer them into a bowl. Now to these, I'm going to add my almond milk and Greek vanilla yogurt. And just mix this all together. Then I'm going to add a quarter cup of brown sugar fresh ground cinnamon and I'm gonna set this aside now for the blueberry sauce I have my pan over medium heat I'm going to add one cup of fresh blueberries along with a quarter cup of brown sugar and a squeeze of fresh lemon juice and this is going to reduce over medium heat for two to three minutes until it turns nice and thick 
like this. And I'm gonna remove this from the heat and let it cool. So here is my oatmeal. You can also add chia seeds to this. Now to this, I am going to add half of my blueberry sauce mixture. The other half I'm gonna reserve for topping when they're served. So I'm just going to gently fold this in and it's gonna turn the oatmeal into this beautiful light purple color. Now I'm gonna cover this with plastic wrap and let it refrigerate for at least eight hours, better yet overnight. So after about eight hours, this is what the oatmeal looks like. Nice and thick. If you want it to be a little more liquidy, you can definitely add more milk. Look at that. Finally, top it with the leftover blueberry sauce. I'm gonna give this a try. I hope that you guys enjoyed my recipe video on how to make super easy and delicious overnight oats. Don't forget to check out these other recipes and check out my blog sugarprincessrecipes.com. All my recipes including this one are on there with precise measurements and instructions.